Hello, and welcome to another edition of Titan's Review Corner. I'm Titan. So, I thought I would do another anime today. This one is from, well, it started in 95. It's technically still going, go figure. The first season of Slayers. Now, as you can see, my box is a little beaten up. Sadly, I got it that way. Anyways. Now, I haven't seen all of Slayers. This is, I'm basing this solely off the first season. I have seen some of the second, and I have seen most or all of the movies, and most or all of the OAVs. Uh, the original series, though, due to, you know, the time, the, the era of anime, it's, it's so interesting and, and engaging, and you just love or hate the characters. You usually love. If not good Ben in this, there might have been some hate, but uh, this is the, the series with Lena and Gowrie and their crazy adventures. And being that it, it has a slightly smaller core cast, I think that's why I like this one a little bit better. That and this is one of the dubs I will recommend. Now when I'm talking about anime, I'm usually talking about the subs. and. Uh, I forgot to mention that in some of the... I will try to mention it from now on, but uh, I'm not a dub person. I, I was for, for a time. This would be part of that time. And I have seen this in Japanese. And there's something about the, the American English voice actors that add to the story rather than taking away like how it usually is, at least for me. Uh, and they have an all-star cast, in my opinion, too, you know, uh, Gallery is Brock and James from Pokemon, and Lena, um, Lisa Ort is, her cast list is also very long, and of course I can't remember anything right now. Most of it, I think she was in Bubblegum Crisis, maybe, maybe not. I mean, a very distinct voice for the character, which fits her so well, especially because she was up against uh, Megumi Hashibato, who is huge in Japan. Uh, her voice is a little bit not quite my cup of tea, so it was nice that, that Lisa sort of translated it to a much more enjoyable watching experience. Um, and, you know, Zell Goddess, I don't even remember his in Japanese. That's kind of sad. Actually, I don't remember Gallery's in Japanese either. Shows you how much I like the dub, which really sang a lot. The first season, you meet up with some of the characters. Some of the characters ha start off evil which is always cool. Uh, you, we have two solid bad guys through the first. The one is sort of, I don't think it quite goes halfway, and then another one picks up for the rest of the season, which I thought was very interesting. You don't usually have that. I mean, even though it's only 26 episodes, it, it's still very interesting. And my favorite episode is, like I think probably on the third disc, uh, let's just say there was not only was I amused because one of the characters was cross-dressing, but also the hairstyle they decided to put them in. And I'll leave it at that. I do recommend this series. If you haven't seen it, definitely do. I give it an A-. minus. There are a couple things that were sort of, yeah, okay, but overall, definitely watchable. There you have it, Slayers. After, after this, there are two more seasons of the original core of, of the Slayers series. It's Next and Try. I got halfway through Next, but due to complications with the voice acting, I didn't like one of the voice actors in English, so I had to switch to Japanese. And it wasn't the same. I was like, do I do I suffer with the voice actor that I really, really hate that is destroying a good character? Or do I watch the Japanese and actually not be quite so entertained? So I, I ended up stopping halfway through. I know I should finish watching it. I actually own all of second season on DVD, and I should get around watching it. So then by the time Try came out, I was like, I haven't finished next. I shouldn't get Try, so... I haven't seen that, and uh, people have told me that it's it's still pretty good, but I, I'm still kind of die hard for the original series. I'll talk about the movies and the OIVs in a in another review because those are all together different. They have a couple different well, 
a different cast member. Sometimes more, sometimes less. So, there you have it. Uh, also, the new Slayers. I wish I could afford it. <laughs> Good night.